are incredibly excited to be at this point. It's effectively the end of the beginning. I am so excited to be here at this symbolic turning of the sod ceremony as we begin our Big Build project. It's going to take Herbert Baker's beautiful 1920s design, but add to it convening facilities, a glass garden pavilion, and 40 bedrooms so that Rhodes Scholars from around the world, our alumni, but also people across the university and the city of Oxford can gather in a spectacular 21st century Rhodes House. When I walked into Rhodes House for the first time, it was overwhelming. First of all, when I was told about Rhodes House, I really expected it to be kind of a small cottage-like house somewhere in Oxford that wasn't really noticeable, but it's a profound building. That feeling resonates in every bone in your body. And so what Rhodes really does is provide that kind of very unique setting where one can interact with their fellow peers um, and learn from one another. But I think it's unique to have all that centralized in, in, in a physical location um, that really encourages students to, to take advantage of those opportunities. Not just for Rhodes Scholars, but to include the wider Oxford community, just to have people come in and to share. And been very fortunate to work with Stanton Williams as architects and to work with now Beard Construction. The Beard team, led by Richie Carter and Adam Price, will work tirelessly in collaboration with you to ensure as a team we transform Rhodes House to be the stunning new centre for Rhodes Scholars and others. We can't wait to welcome you to the transformed Rhodes House and all of the good that this transformed building will mean for our community and for the broader community of Oxford. The turning of the sod. <laughs> here's to Rhodes House. Here's to our partnership with Beard Construction, Stanton Williams, to all who've made this possible, our trustees, our benefactors, Atlantic Philanthropies and others, and to the broader Rhodes community and Oxford communities. Cheers to Rhodes House. <laughs>